A devastating 7.8 magnitude earthquake struck Turkey and Syria just over a year ago. Earthquakes know no borders. Greece and three other Black Sea countries, including Turkey, have decided to share data and harmonise their methodologies to improve cross-border cooperation in seismic risk management. The aim of this European project called Red Act, the Rapid Earthquake Damage Assessment Consortium, is to rapidly identify damage and facilitate rescue operations. This platform is installed in Greece, in uh, Turkey, in uh, Romania, in Moldova. So we use the same methodology and produce uh, the same uh, results in terms of uh, seismic motion at, of the ground level of the soil. After uh, uh, 10 or 15 minutes, we may have some first estimations from the RADA platform in order to provide it to the, to the authorities. At the Institute of Seismology in Thessaloniki, earthquakes in the Black Sea Basin are monitored in real time. And they happen often. This is the earthquake, small earthquake, in Mytilini, eastern Greece. And this is noise before the earthquake, you see? The Institute is responsible for low-cost wireless accelerometers that measure seismic vibrations. Around 30 of them have been installed here in Thessaloniki. We have installed the seismobacks, these small accelerometers, low cost, in different soil conditions in 31 schools in the city. So we can have an idea of the amplification of the different geological layers, plus of the seismic action to the specific school, five minutes after the event. This will make it possible to identify the most critical parts of the buildings and the appropriate emergency measures. The total budget for Red Act is almost 1 million euros. 92% has been funded by the EU's cohesion policy. Greece, Romania, Moldova and Turkey are also participating. All earthquakes with a magnitude of four and above are investigated because they are strong enough to damage infrastructure. A few minutes after an earthquake, the Red Act platform produces maps of soil liquefaction, a process that generates a liquid from a solid or a gas and landslides. Why is it useful? They are definitely very helpful already preactively by preparing scenarios or reactively by saying which uh, area we should go first, we should focus our efforts after an earthquake. The project also focuses on education and provides online services such as information sheets, questionnaires as well as an app that can tell your loved ones where you are, what shelters are less than a five minute walk away and what to do in the event of an earthquake.